We've gone through a series of meditations clearing each one of the chakras. And tonight we finish with the crown. This is your inspiration and your openness to receive that inspiration from the higher realms, from what you might consider your angels or your guides, or simply from your own super conscious higher self mind that wants to help you find the right path in your life, connect you with the right people and the right opportunities that are also looking for you. But we can't find those connections if we don't take time to listen and to trust our own intuition, our own inner guidance system. So tonight is about opening up to receive the information from your inner guidance system as we open the crown chakra. As always, you'll want to find a place to do this meditation that's peaceful and quiet. You want to turn off any distractions around you. As with every meditation, you can do this either sitting in a chair with your feet on the floor, or if you want, be in lotus position with your legs crossed. I'm in lotus right now, but whatever you feel most comfortable in is what you should do. However, your spine must be facing up towards the sky. And let's begin. We always want to start out checking our grounding cord, feeling connecting to the earth first. So just go ahead and feel yourself relaxing and really feeling the feeling of the earth underneath you. Feeling stable and grounded. You don't want to drift off. And on the other hand, I want you to pull your skull and your head a little bit up towards the heavens, tucking your chin under. And you want to rest your tongue on the roof of your mouth. And the reason we do this is it creates a circuit of energy within the body. So, get comfy, and let's begin. Go ahead and take a deep breath in. And let it go. Take another deep breath in. And let it go. Slowly another deep breath in. Expanding the lungs fully. Oh, then letting go of any of the stresses of your day so you can be fully present here. Now I want you to run your grounding cord all the way down to the center of the earth. Just imagine a cord of light dropping down the bottom of your spine and into the heart of Mother Earth. And you'll feel it when it clicks in. You can feel that Earth energy beginning to run through you. Continuing to breathe slow, deep breaths. I feel a tingling at the top of my head even before we've done the invocation to open the crown. So that tells me that we're really ready to go tonight. And invite space to receive. Invite into yourself the possibility of having a profound experience tonight. With each breath calming, feeling more focused and centered.
allowing the flow of energy to move through your body. And now I want you to imagine that a warm, powerful light is moving up from the earth, first into the base of your spine. This is your root chakra. Imagine flowing up the legs into the base of the spine and moving up into the sacral chakra right between your hips. Glowing red and then orange and now moving into your third chakra slowly. This energy works its way up into your heart each breath. And now up through your throat. And into your third eye, the center of your head. And finally, out the crown at the top of your head. Imagine a lotus, a thousand petaled lotus opening at the top of your head, opening to receive your cosmic wisdom and your insights that have been waiting to come through. Picture a bright, brilliant light shining at the top of your mind. Of it is God's spotlight coming through and shining the light on you. With each breath, just receiving this light coming down from the heavens. this time, invite guidance into your awareness, invite inspiration into your soul, and be still, witness what happens as we breathe together. Invoke that guidance from above. Bless us with the knowledge and the inspiration to fulfill our true purpose in being here.
as we open the crown, we connect ourselves to the universe, to all things. Connected to the psychic internet. Receiving downloads and even giving uploads. In this way, we are connected to an invisible world, ever present around us. If you have questions in your life, this is the time to ask them. This is where answers can show up. So in the stillness of your mind, offer up your questions and just see what comes. And it will come as a subtle voice, almost a whisper or an image or a feeling. Invite the presence of our own higher selves to now move in and become our conscious selves. We surrender our need to control all of the details of our lives, knowing there is a more beautiful plan for us than we could have possibly have known about up to this point. As you feel this link to all that is, continue to breathe, circulate this divine energy. Cosmos wants to give you your heart's desires if you're open to receiving them. If you're willing to let go of the old stories from telling yourself you are.
see a line of energy connecting your crown, the purple soft glow of your crown, and the open petals of the crown's lotus, running the energy down through your mind, your heart, all the way down to your roots, the part of you that can take action on all of the insights that are now being brought to you. open and the energy is flowing throughout our system, just see all of yourself shining, luminous white light all around you. gratitude to be alive and be here on this mysterious journey. As we live in this vibration and this openness to receiving our divine guidance, our life becomes more effortless, more in the flow. And opportunities are mysteriously attracted to us. meditation. We're going to end by reciting a mantra. Very simple. I receive the insights of the divine. Repeat this or just hear it in your own mind. I'm going to repeat this a few times so we can feel it. The purpose of the mantra is so you can feel what's behind the mantra, the energy of it. I receive the insights of the divine. 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 I receive the insights 
of the divine. I receive the insights of the divine. And so understand that over the next few hours and days, new information from your guides and from higher realms is going to come to you. So stay open and pay attention to those interesting thoughts you have, those unusual ideas. Maybe they're trying to tell you something. Look for the signs and the synchronicities that will guide you. Because we are on an incredible adventure here on Earth. And anyone who tells you otherwise hasn't yet understood the beauty of the mystery. longer, please do so. Or, if you're ready, slowly bring your present awareness to your room, your body, and open your eyes. Thank you.